<laughs> Anything different about Michigan State since the first time you played them? Uh, no, we well, we we got a different approach coming, different game plan because obviously we lost our last matchup. Would you like to let us in on any of the secrets? No, <laughs> we'll see when it comes game time. All right. <laughs> Alan, they play really good. I mean, they're at the top of the conference in defense. But what's the key to kind of cracking their defense or just staying in what you guys want to do offensively? Uh, play with pace. Uh, don't be relaxed on the offensive end. Uh, we worked on that in practice today, running with pace, and it looked really good. What's been the conversation since the Maryland loss? Um, really no conversation. You know, it's the next one. Uh, we're, we just started getting prepared for Michigan State because we know we own one. What was that energy like Friday night? Uh, Friday night? Yeah, with the, here at home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I forgot. It was, it was, it was nice. Uh, uh, the energy the, from the fans, from, from everybody on the bench, everybody. Uh, it was nice even though we came up short. Uh, the energy was good. How do you balance the second game against someone because you know more about them, but they also know more about you as well? Uh, seeing who uh, comes up with the better game plan executes uh, from the last one. Obviously, we got to switch some things up. They probably switched some things up too. Uh, now we'll see uh, who comes out with the win. Expect Izzo to throw a zone at you tomorrow? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Uh, I think they played low zone uh, last game, and teams know we kind of struggled uh, a little bit with it, but we worked on that in practice today. I should be ready. Oh, well, are, are you there goes one of them keys. You saw. <laughs> are you going to beat the zone buster? You're the, the yeah. low range threat? Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Yeah. What's, what do you think is the hardest part of the zone for this team? Um, Hardest part, probably just finding, just trying to get, trying to get the ball inside. Uh, we've been working on getting the ball inside because once we get inside, it makes the zone collapse. They all turn the back, so it opens up on the perimeter. But we got George and Kofi down there, do some work. Coach said that the second half of the Maryland game, they're just, the team as a whole kind of they passed up some shots they should have taken. I mean, is that in your mindset? Is like if you've got an open look, however brief it is that you should maybe get a shot up? Yeah, uh, the mindset is definitely different. Uh, we, we did pass up some some shots in the Maryland game, but then uh, as we were watching the film, coach was like, don't pass them up. You know, uh, them easy shots may not come back. But yeah, we, we won't pass up anymore. Michigan State comes in uh, losing three games in a row. That doesn't happen that much up at East Lansing. Do you guys expect a feisty bunch yeah, of Spartans sure. tomorrow night? Yeah, for sure. We expect probably the best from them. Uh, Tomorrow night, uh, you know they were, they lost three in, all, three in a row, but we also lost two, um, and we're both ready to uh, see who those bigger punches. I mean, after winning seven in a row, now you know, losing two in a row. Mm -hmm. I mean, is that affected you guys at all, or how do you make a deal? Not with at them? all. Uh, Coach has talked about uh, how Maryland also lost two in a row. Uh, they also went on their losing streak. Uh, what are they? Uh, like six games now. Uh, just willing to bounce back and. Uh, be ready for the next game, you know, it's the next one, and uh, have a different mindset. Sounds good. No problem.